During a rally in New York on Tuesday, Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump impersonated former GOP nominee Mitt Romney choking. The last election should have been won, except Romney choked like a dog. He choked. He went, I can't breathe. There's been an ongoing dispute between the two candidates, and it's not the first time Trump has said Romney should have won the 2012 presidential election. Like in Maine last month. He's a choke artist. He's an absolute, and I started hitting him so hard. In fact, people say, why'd you hit him so hard? Because we cannot take another loss. And in New Hampshire in August. Mitt Romney let us down. He should have won that election. He failed. He choked. In the end, no different than a golfer that misses a putt on the 18th hole. Fast forward to Tuesday, and Trump extended that golf metaphor by comparing Jordan Spieth's recent Masters tournament loss to Romney's. Though Trump said Spieth will recover, while well, Romney can't. About six months ago, Trump didn't seem to be nearly as much on Romney's radar, even after Trump had publicly said he'd choked. But will you support Donald Trump if he's the nominee in the end? Um, I, I will support the Republican nominee. I don't think that's going to be Donald Trump. But last month, Romney outlined criticisms of Trump in an almost 20 minute long speech. Here's what I know. Donald Trump is a phony, a fraud. His promises are as worthless as a degree from Trump University. Trump actually endorsed Romney during the 2012 presidential election. The businessman leads the race for the 2016 nomination, but is still fighting to keep the Republican convention from being contested. For Newsy, I'm Ryan Beek.